How you doing? Welcome to Talk Tech with Hash Guide. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can remove a background from a video with the green screen using Kden Live. So let's get started. Before we get started, please make sure you subscribe to this YouTube channel and check out my other social links in the description. Okay, so this is Kden Live, the open source video editing tool that is provided to us by a community of developers who work on this project in their own spare time and they provide it to us for free but if you go to the Caden Live official website and you look down at the bottom I'm sure there will be a donation spot if you like the product and you have anything to donate please do it will keep the product going and keep updates coming but uh, so let's speak about some features on Caden Live. Uh, it's got multi-track audio and video for easy editing. You can import and export any type of audio and video file format. Um, you, you configure the user interface and keyboard shortcuts any way you like so you can match any previous tool. If you're a beginner you can find the best layout that works best for you. It also comes with many useful and important effects and transitions to edit your videos and proxy editing is a great feature if you're running on an older machine or an older computer and it, it's too slow uh, Kden Live will automatically generate a lower resolution video file or of your clips and you can do the edits and effects and when you render the file at the end of the project it will render the project in full resolution for you so that is a great feature it has I, I don't know if Adobe Premiere has that or any of the other open shot uh, tools but uh, uh, another great feature of Kden Live is the automatic backups uh, while you're working it will automatically save backups so if your computer or the program crashes it, when you open Kden Live next it automatically comes back to your previous project and also check out the Kden Live online resources. There's uh, plenty of additional add ons like extra effects, transitions, wipes, and title templates that you can use with the next project. So let's get started. This is the main screen you see when you first open Kden Live. And you know, it's got all the regular features any video editing software will have. I'm just going to get right into it. This is the project bin. I'm going to actually just drag a couple files right into it uh, I got my picture that I'm gonna put as the background and then I got my green screen video right here so we're gonna drag the, the green screen video to the second video track because you want the image that's in the background to go before on the first track or on the track before the video so we're just going to drag this image down here and we can stretch it to the end so it will last the whole video. Uh, the first thing we want to do is click on effects and we type right here in the search bar chroma key. Chroma key basic is the one we're going to be using. We just drag it on the clip with the green screen and then we click on the clip and you can see here on the properties the color key this is the default color that Kden Live uses for the background, but we can change that. And variance is just the shades of color that work with your background. So when you click on the color, you can click on pick screen color and just find a good good shade of the color of the background. If you have more lights facing in the background, it will work a lot better with, for you. But um, for now, this will do. Uh, as you can see right here, there's a little bit of green left, but if you change the variance, you'll notice it changed the shades of the, of the green. So you, you raise this up a little bit, and it will get rid of the rest of the green around me. So, as you can see here, the video has a whole new background. I hope you like this video. Please subscribe to the YouTube channel right now. Give me a thumbs up if you like this and share with a friend. And also, check out my social media accounts in the description. Please follow 
and subscribe. Thank you.